before I begin painting a silk, I always cleanse my energy. I say a prayer, a blessing to bring in the light. And then I touch the silk and I give it energy. I thank the silk for being the medium, for the energy, for the light, for the color, for the light worker that I'm making it for. In this instance, the silk wanted me to move to the corners, to the four corners, and I felt that was significant. Bringing in the four corners of the earth, the four elements, the four energies. I always go with my feeling, whatever feels right. And everything's different. <laughs> Every silk is different. I intuit the colors by using a pendulum and right now five colors want to go onto the silk. So I have the colors ready, some of them are ready to be painted on and some of them are going to be sprayed on. Again I use a pendulum to ask which ones want to be sprayed and which ones want to be painted. Then I take the first color and I invite my intuition to tell me what to paint. And here we have stars. Count the stars. The number's significant. This is turquoise. Turquoise is a color of communication, of teaching, of star quality, of sharing inspiration. It also links with the internet and media. And the second color has a similar vibe it also has this turquoise color this teal color so it's like a double turquoise and these wanted to go on as streams like trails from shooting stars this really felt like it was in the clouds in the sky and I also felt as I was painting these that they were connecting connecting lots of people that the people were the stars connecting with the media, connecting with people that are like-minded. The spray is gray, and again, it felt like it was stardust, just going on in between randomly, between the stars onto the stars. And it also felt like it was a balancing color you know, the gray areas that this person is slipping in between. It doesn't have to be black and white. It can be gray. The fourth color was a yellow and this wanted to go on a spiral. So count the spirals. Spirals are significant. They are, they link in with the chakras, with energy that's moving around and through you. To me, they also link with the goddess as well and a connection to women. So I felt that this person had a strong link with working with women. When you get turquoise and this yellow color, there's a connection with writing. So then the final color is violet and this wanted to go on as a spray and it wanted to fill in some of the white spaces. So it's not it's not a pattern as such that is equal on each side. It's just a random pattern. And once I finished that, I got this sense that I needed to put salt into each of those little blobs of violet. Violet is a color of the spirit. It links to a higher mind. And when it comes in with the yellow and the blue there, and also with green, because the, the yellow is creating green with the blue, it's saying that this person is opening up lots of avenues for people, connecting the dots. And when the silk was finished, it almost looked like they were pin marks on a board and marks on a map. Violet is a, a color of change, of transformation. 
and underneath the, the violet there emerged this beautiful orange, vibrant orange. And it really looked like they were colors of change, of movement, of transformation, but also of, of living in different places. So when you look at this, you can see the, the dots almost lift off the silk. There's a lot of green in the silk and this is lovely and healing. This is such a beautiful energy. If you would like to have your own soul rainbow silk, then you can take a look at my store, store.sealwithlove.com. You can see more videos there and you can order your own silk. It's personal to you and you get a write up about all the different energies, the colors, the vibrations and the messages. Thank you for watching.